It's championship week in the 2023 college football season, and the action kicks off with a monster matchup tonight, as No. 5 Oregon takes on No. 3 Washington in the Pac-12 title game at Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas. Heisman Trophy hopefuls Bo Nix and Michael Penix Jr. will have a primetime stage to leave one last impressive on voters. But that's not all that's at stake, as the Huskies, 12-0, and Ducks, 11-1, two of the four conference teams ranked in the AP Top 25, will battle for an almost certain spot in the college football playoff. The Pac-12 has not placed a team in the playoffs since the Huskies made it in the 2016 season. And the backdrop to all of this is the fact that this is the last Pac-12 game as we know it, as while the name of the conference might live on in some fashion, every school in the league, other than Oregon State and Washington State, is heading to other conferences next year. Washington and Oregon will be Big Ten Conference rivals, while their respective state rivals try to keep the Pac-12 going in some form with the help of an alliance with the Mountain West. A victory for Washington would cap a perfect season, which would include beating Oregon twice, that will continue into the CFP. A win for Oregon means the Ducks are Pac-12 champs, but a Final Four spot is not guaranteed. Here are the top moments. Number 5 Oregon vs. Number 3 Washington 648, Touchdown, Huskies. If you're going to blitz Michael Penix you better get home, otherwise he might connect on a long pass, as he did on a 45-yard gain to Jalen McMillan. One play later, Jeremy Bernard scored from 4 yards out to make it 17-3.8, 492Q, Oregon on the board. Oregon's first good drive of the game covered 72 yards in 11 plays before stalling out in the red zone. A 36-yard field goal pulled Oregon within 10-3.9, 32Q. Troy Franklin sets a record Oregon has put together a nice drive, with Troy Franklin making plays, including an 11-yard gain off a short pass in which he danced away from multiple defenders. That play was his 78th catch of the season, an Oregon record. End of 1 Q. Washington leads 10-0 There is a lot of football left, but the Huskies have dominated so far. Washington leads in time of possession, 13-13 to 147. Total plays, 25-6, and total yards, 117-9.2. 31. Oregon's offense in slow motion so far Oregon has run six offensive plays so far and has yet to earn a first down. Another drive, another punt for the Ducks.3, 46-1Q, touchdown, Huskies. A fine punt return set Washington up with a short field, and the Huskies took advantage with a six-play scoring drive. Dylan Johnson punched it in with a six-yard run around the left end. Johnson already has 53 rushing yards on 9 carries, an average of 5.8 yards per carry.7, 24-1 Q. 3 and out the prowess of Oregon's offense is well documented, but Washington's defense had a strong start. The Huskies even got a little help from an, un, official extra defender, 